Corral pumps. Pressure again. And two torn ACLs, and now Corral is struggling to get to his feet. He is in pain. Yo, what is up, everyone? We're back today with another video. Um, I originally waited till this morning to see how Matt Corral's x-rays came back, as uh, that could be a very big factor in where he's drafted in the draft, because I did have him going a very early pick in terms of he was the first quarterback that I had picked in my mock draft, so I do not have that out but maybe sometime I can get it out, but this could affect his draft value as he came back on crutches, but it appears that his x-rays came back negative. So, I don't really know if they meant negative and like it was bad or if they meant negative like negative. I'm pretty sure that's what the article meant. So, as you saw in the play I showed you at the beginning, Matt Corral had a defensive lineman fall on his ankle, which he then would be helped off to the field, into the medical tent, out of the med medical tent, onto a car, into the locker room. And then, obviously, like I said, he returned on crutches without any shoulder pads. So... His draft value, in my opinion, is him and Kenny Pickett are the best two quarterbacks in the draft. And maybe this will be something that teams look over or look past. But I think it could be a very big factor in his career. Because if... He, if people end up saying that he's too injured and when he goes to the combine he does not perform at 100%, this could be a term of who knows because Kenny Pickett could go before him even though maybe Kenny Pickett's not necessarily the better player. But we'll see how they both perform in the combine which still is a long time away. But... If it's just sprained, I don't know. But this could be a very big factor. So let's dive into what and why I think this could be a big factor. So, Kenny Pickett and Matt Corral, in my opinion, are very similar quarterbacks in the style that they play. They both can use their legs. They are great passers. The one thing that stands out to me about Matt Corral is maybe he's just gotten this from the while he's been with Lane Kiffin, but um, he actually has adapted to be calm to the fourth down as going for it instead of maybe kicking the points, which is good because he's learning to be calm under pressure. But I don't know if the NFL will use that trait that much. Because right now they don't. But. Uh, it seems to me that. This could be another Joe Burrow situation. Where it's an injury. We don't have to worry about it. It's basically just a little down part in his career and me thinking that maybe it could be something big maybe a little bit of an over uh exaggerating statement but I don't know really because no one really knows if this could be bad or if this is okay because every player takes it a different way so, with that being said, um, 
that's it for today's video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Um, and, yeah, see you guys in the next video. Peace. Uh, uh, okay.